Hey everybody, I am Mary Phillips and I'm super excited to be partnering with Trini London today to show you how I got this beautiful soft glam look. These products are incredible. They are really easy to use. I love using creams. I have been a big fan of cream products my entire career. They're really easy to use and they have incredible staying power. So here we go. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the Golden Glow in the color Gaia. I love this product, it's a bronzer. It's not too dark, it's pretty subtle. I'm gonna go around my hairline, on my cheekbones, a little bit on my eyelids, across my nose, all the places that the sun would hit. This is just a little bit darker than my skin, but I all I'm looking for right now is just like a little bit of warmth. I'm gonna go right on the forehead. You always wanna think of like the places you get like a little red in the sun. And I'm gonna go along the cheeks, like right on the top, almost kind of where your blush will go as well, but you wanna add that little bit of warmth. And we're gonna fake that tan. I'm gonna go across the eyelids too. I love doing this. It, it kind of makes the whole makeup look seamless. I kind of always will take like a little bit of bronzer or blush and go on the eyelids before I start as like a good base. I'm gonna go a little across the nose just to get that little bit of tan in there. And I'm just lightly gonna go on the lower face just to kind of my neck to make everything match a little bit. Okay, for the second product, I am going to use the Flush Blush, and this is the color Shmooji. I love cream blushes. They're really easy to blend, and they go on really easily. They blend really easily. It looks super natural. And I'm gonna go across the nose, because I like that kind of like little sunburnt look a little bit. Makes it look real natural. And I definitely like to apply the blush on the higher side. I feel like it's a very youthful look. I'm also going to take this brush and just dust it across the lids. It's going to be a little base for my shadow. I'm just going to bump it up a little bit more with the blush. So this is the eye to eye in the color Faith. So I'm just going to take my brush and just go back and forth, just creating a really soft eye look. Just back and forth, and this is these are super blendable. So if you get a little too much product, you can just take your finger or the brush and just kind of keep blending it out. You can even use your finger to apply, you know, if you're like on the go or doing it, you know, while you're in your Uber or in, if you're in your car, you know, parked, not driving. Okay, now I'm gonna take a little bit of a smaller brush and just go real softly under the eye. Now I'm just taking a little bit more. And I'm gonna go real close to the lash line. Now I'm just going in the crease a little bit. And a little bit more in the outer corner. And I'm just gonna do a little bit more underneath. More just kind of like blending it. Okay. Next I'm gonna use the Lip to Cheek in the color Freddy. And I'm going to take a little lip brush and line my lips and then gently tap the color in my lips. And I'm also gonna add a little bit on the cheeks um, and bump up the blush a bit. Okay. 
just to give the lips a little natural color. And now I'm gonna take my blush brush, just go back over the cheeks. I love blush, so I'm just gonna add a little bit more. Just to give it a little more of a bump. Just a little more. And for the last product, I'm going to use the Right Light in the color Candlelight. I always save highlighter last. It's kind of like the icing on the cake to me or adds those little tiny little bits of, of light at the end. So it's also one of my favorite things to do at the end. So I'm just gonna take my finger and just get like right where you want the light to hit your face on the top of the cheekbones. I usually do the tops of my cheekbones and the bridge of my nose. Sometimes my cupid's bow a little bit. You could put them on the, under the brow, um, in the corner of the eye. You can also take a little bit and add it to the center of the eye if you want a little shimmer. I'm just gonna take my blush brush and kind of lightly dust over that just to kind of blend anything out and make it seamless. And then I just applied a thin coat of mascara to complete the look. I hope you guys loved watching my beautiful soft glam look using my Trini London products.